Hello, at HP Pharmacy, we provide our patients with compounded version of semiglutide and terzepatide. Your prescription will contain a vial, insulin syringe that is clearly marked with a red line so you know where to draw it up to, and some alcohol pads. On our label, it will also contain the strength of the medication, the volume in milliliter, and the units but then again, we will also mark them for you. First thing first, before you give yourself injection, make sure you wash your hands very thoroughly. Then, you are going to get an alcohol pad. You are going to wipe down the same direction about three times. Make sure you let the vial dry up a little bit. Now, this insulin syringe, the key point is that you make sure that you do not let anything touch the needle during this process. It has a little cap at the, bio, at the bottom and the actual insulin syringe. Before you draw up the syringe, make sure you will draw up the empty barrel up to the red mark as indicated, fill it with air you are going to go straight down to the vial. These insulin syringes are very thin and fragile, so be very gentle and careful when you drop your dose. I'm going to push the plunger down that was filled with air, and then draw up the dose past the red mark. You can adjust a little bit as I do back and forth to reduce air bubbles. Ultimately, make sure the plunger is at the red mark and now you're ready to inject yourself all right now that we have drawn up the dose we're going to inject it ourselves i recommend two inches away from your navel area whether it's left or right you are going to use the alcohol swab on your bare skin make sure you alcohol swab either side let it dry for a second and when you inject yourself, you're going to pinch, go straight in, and press the plunger all the way. Wait a second, and then pull it out. Now, you want to make sure that the alcohol is completely dried to minimize the pain. Also, trust me, it really does not hurt. It's a very, very small syringe, a very, very small needle as well, so you will barely feel anything. As long as you're pinching yourself, the, 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 the force of pinching will be probably greater than you actually injecting yourself. Make sure that you inject all the way and let it stay for a second and then take it out so you get your full dose. 